we will discuss the transradial approach for acute MI interventions. You all know that acute MI intervention is in any case a very high bleeding prone situation. And if you know how to tackle acute MI through transradial approach, then you remain away from major vascular complications. That is the reason why it is so important to deal with acute MI intervention. This is a case of acute anterior wall MI. LAD is totally occluded after its origin. An EBU 3.56F guide catheter was used and a BMW PTCA wire was negotiated across the lesion. Wire was parked in distal LAD. Ballooning was done. Stenting in progress. This is an optimal end result. Selective RCA injection using a 6FJR4 guide catheter revealed total occlusion with a large thrombus in the mid part. The lesion was crossed using a 0 0.014 inch Whisper PTCA guide wire. PTCA was done. Stenting in progress. Here you see an optimal end result. Selective LMCA injection through a 6F EBU 3.5 guide catheter reveals a total occlusion of LMCA with a large thrombus. An RCA injection reveals retrograde filling of LCA. A 0 0.014 inch BMW PTCA guide wire was deployed and PTCA was performed. Stent was positioned. Stent was then deployed you can see excellent end result of primary PCI of LMCA. This is a selective LMCA injection through a 6F EBU 3.5 guide catheter which reveals a total occlusion of LMCA with a large thrombus. Another view reveals partial recanalization. A big thrombus is seen sitting at the LMCA bifurcation, IABP was deployed to support the hemodynamics. Two BMW PTCA wires were deployed, one in LAD and one in LCX. PTCA in progress, stenting in progress, stenting in progress. Here you see excellent result of primary PCI of LMCA. This is another view showing the result. This is an example of acute inferior wall MI and cardiogenic shock showing a huge thrombus burden in large RCA. Deep intubation of a 6F JR4 guide catheter was performed. The distal tip of catheter was placed at the site of thrombus. Thrombosuction was performed through the guide catheter itself. A large amount of thrombus was removed. RCA injection after thrombosuction reveals a good flow. The lesion was then stented. This is the final result. 